morning, everyone. Uh, it is really honor and privilege, and I'm very humble to share in this special event uh, as this today, as a graduation day. Uh, but to be honest with you, uh, I've never experienced speaking with such fancy dress. <laughs> Usually I, I wear pants <laughs> most of the time, so. <laughs> uh, but uh, it is really, really privileged to be here and to share. Um, for many years, have been a dream for me uh, to study theological. Uh, but for many, many, many reasons, um, was impossible. Uh, well, the main reason actually was because in Albania there is not a theologic seminary. That was the main one. Uh, also, also in all the region there. So God opened the door in an amazing way that three years ago, uh, my wife and I, to move here together with our family, uh, with two children, uh, Lydia and Jacob, and we moved here. We have no idea what we're doing. <laughs> Never been uh, in, in Charlotte. We had no idea. We checked on email, that's it, that we did. <laughs> uh, but it's been an amazing experience. Um, as I was preparing to share something for today, something was coming uh, a lot in my mind, keep coming in my mind and in my heart. The joy that is today, in this particular day, in this room, especially also to students, uh, the joy that all of us are experiencing today. Well, I just want to say, yesterday I was saying, yes, no more assignment, no more homework. <laughs> I should not say that in the front of my professor, but, <laughs> <laughs> but it's a part of me also that I will miss it because I like to study and to go deep in God's word. And yes, we, we are celebrating that we are finishing, but in the same time, um, doesn't finish here. We are continuing, going, studying, and studying more deeply. Um, I, uh, I remember especially the 11.55 p.m. <laughs> Most of the students know that. What does that mean? <laughs> Uh, every, every Monday was the assignment that you needed to submit. And it was so much stress that 11.55, you need to submit. <laughs> Otherwise, you are in trouble. So. <laughs> but all of us, all of us know that there is a such joy today in every of us. Hmm? not only students, also family, friend, um, because of perseverance, faithfulness, and the endurance that all of us as students, we went through. And to be honest, uh, uh, some of us, for some of us, it's been a high cost. but we were ready to pay the high cost because we had the goal. I remember entering on the first day Gordon Conwell's door, and probably you too. We, we entered and we came here with a goal in our mind to put God first and to follow his call for our life. We didn't come here because we didn't know what to do with our life. And now, in this day, in this particular day, we are joyful, just celebrating 
that faithfulness, that endurance, that struggle, hard time, hard working. The piece of paper that we are going to receive today symbolize the knowledge that we gain in our study. That's why there is a lot of joy. But as we leave this door, as we leave and finish Gordon Conwell, we continue another seminary that does not finish in a few years. Actually, that seminary will continue till the end of our life. And I like to call this seminary the seminary of the good and faithful servants. And such seminary requires similar virtue, perseverance, faithfulness, endurance, and most of all, loving God with all that we have. Loving him with all that we have. Such seminary requires of us to live out and practice what we have learned in Gordon Conwell. So we might find ourselves graduated that day from that other seminary. Now I cannot imagine, just think a little bit, the joy of that day when all of us, not only students, all of us that we are in this room, will be graduated by the Lord himself. What a graduation day is ahead of us. What a graduation day is stored for us. When all of us will be called good and faithful servant, come and enter my court. Come and enter my joy. My encouragement to all of us today is that as we experience a glimpse of internal joy by being graduated from the hard work, for homeworks, from assignment, but let continue, let keep in mind, let continue to be faithful, full of compassion, loving God and perseverance in any time. Imagine the day of that graduation, entering the internal joy, the best joy that is still, is still ahead of us. In closing, I just want to express my gratitude and deep respect for each professor and the academic faculty that they have been such a blessing to my life and I'm pretty sure to each of the students. The heart that Gordon Conwell expressed for reaching the world, for the mission and training leaders and pastors internationally that don't have that opportunity to have a theologic education like me. So I'm very, very thankful. They, they have poured out from their heart with their humility. They've, they've, they are a great example for us. And I'm so, so thankful for each of them today. So graduation to all students are being graduated today. As we finish Gordon Conwell, we are continuing the other seminary of God, of good, sorry, and faithful servants. God bless.